Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Wing Nut Wednesday. Guys, we got some barbecue news for you. The results from last week's Memphis in May. Also, we're gonna be giving away some goodies or a goodie, depending on how you look at it. Okay, if you guys recall from last weekend, I reported on the Memphis in May barbecue contest for 2022 going on in, yep, Memphis, Tennessee. So I just wanna congratulate last week's winner for the Wing Nut Wednesday. Douglas Condor, he won some Grillaholics SPG and SPG Plus Butter, two 12 ounce bottles of that good stuff. So uh, congratulations, Douglas, really appreciate it. And of course, hey sunshine, regrets. And of course we announced that last winner in our cooking video, which was a patty melt. And man, was it a patty melt. Me and Sassy cooked up a fabulous sandwich, guys, and uh, be sure to go check out that video. I'll leave it right up here. It's probably the best patty melt I've ever had, bar none, uh, so check it out. There were a lot of winners, obviously, at this year's Memphis in May, and I'm going to point us to their website just to name a few of them. So, guys, I'm just going to cut to the chase and go for the grand champion. Congratulations to Blues Hog uh, 2022 grand champion guys uh, I'm gonna leave a video down in the description to their 2021 video that was uh, created by the barbecue league of their 2021 uh, pork shoulder champion uh, it's part one I'm not sure when the part two is gonna come out but uh, anyway I subscribe to their channel too it's uh, pretty decent stuff and uh, uh, it might give an insight of what it takes and what they did to become a grand champion this year. So go check it out. I've also used Blues Hogs seasonings uh, and it, it's pretty good stuff. So I hope these are the same guys. I'm pretty sure they are, uh, but I really like the Blues Hog seasonings. I don't have enough of it. Uh, so uh, maybe, uh, maybe we'll get some one of these days. So congratulations, Blues Hog 2022 grand champion. Um, for ribs, first place, Heath Riles. Uh, second place, Bluff City Smokers. For the shoulder, first place, Sweet Swine O' Mine. And uh, second place, Cool Smoke. And the whole hog, guys, Blues Hog took that first place with second place, Boar's Night Out. Um, I'm going to flash up on the screen. Obviously, all the other people that placed, um, they definitely deserved recognition. So I'm going to leave a link down in the description to the Memphis and May Dot org website go check it out yourself be sure to congratulate them and uh, they deserve it man that, that was that was something else so one of the interesting little tidbits uh, that I read today that uh, meat and poultry prices since this time last year have gone up uh, 14 or 15 percent um, didn't really seem to uh, phase the competitors though uh, I don't think they're gonna really sweat over a couple bucks more for some pork shoulder uh, or, or some ribs. Uh, we certainly haven't, uh, we haven't changed how we're cooking uh, too much. I think really with this inflation where it's hitting us is in the uh, fuel and filling up my diesel. Uh, you know, that's definitely gotten expensive, but uh, for the most part, you know, we got to eat. We love barbecue. You know, we're not going to let a couple dollars get in the way. Meat Stick has generously agreed to give a winner of today's Wingnut Wednesday, a $25 gift card or credit to their website on anything that you want. Um, I think it's being very generous, guys. All right, guys, they basically have three models of this meat stick. They have the limited range model with the two yellow stripes uh, to easily recognize which one you're working with. Um, it comes also with the docking station. Uh, then they have the meat stick X. Uh, 260 foot range, uh, definitely plenty of range there for most backyard cooks, uh, shouldn't give you much of a problem. Now what I found with some of these more extended range type of probes is that uh, on some of the smaller smokers, uh, smaller wall thickness of steel that is, like a, a pellet smoker that's just built out of sheet metal, you'll get some decent ranges out of it, but not very far, guys. But you put it below one of those quarter inch thick doors on like a Yoder uh, or mil, uh, mil spec smoker or Franklin smoker, anything like that, uh, reduced very drastically, guys, and you probably have to go into some uh, wired. And then they have the unlimited 
Wi-Fi bridge set with the unlimited range. Uh, pretty nice looking little uh, base station. Uh, has a carrying case. You get two of these meat sticks. Um, and of course the Wi-Fi bridge. Um, $200, uh, not a bad deal. You're gonna get $25 off of this if you happen to be the winner of the this week's Wingnut Wednesday. So what does it take to become a winner? Pretty simple guys, there's three rules with a four, with a fourth shot kind of rule. One, you gotta be a subscriber to this channel. Two, you gotta like this video. Three, comment down below on this video and tell us what you think. I would like to hear what you guys plan on using this on uh, if you win, or if you just decide to go get you one, or if you already have a meat stick, uh, tell us what you think about, about it. Drop a link uh, in the comments and uh, see your reviews. Uh, basically, I'd like to know more. Um, there's a lot of these products out on the market <clears throat> nowadays, and uh, it's almost uh, at the point where the market's becoming saturated. Um, so I'd like to see what you guys really think of this product. And that's about it, guys. One little fourth little small little side requirement. Uh, we need a U.S. mailing address, guys. That's probably not a big deal, but uh, just a U.S. mailing address. We'll share it with the meat stick, guys, and they will uh, uh, work out the details with you to get you that $25 off uh, on their website. And of course, I'll drop a link to their website here and you can go check it out. Uh, but the winner will be drawn randomly from the comment picker, random uh, application uh, on the next cooking video, uh, which should be sometime uh, by this weekend. So anyway, guys, that's about it. Hey, appreciate you guys stopping by on this Wingnet Wednesday. Tell us what you think about this little short series of giveaways. Um, I'm looking for possibly giving away much bigger prizes, much bigger things. Uh, possibly going live. So tell us what you think about that. Comment down below uh, what you'd like us to uh, do in the future. What kind of format would you like to see? So anyway, guys, um, thanks again. Uh, be sure to subscribe. You've already subscribed. You've already liked the video and comment down below. I know because you want to win more prizes. So do it and we'll see you later.